Well, I think on a number of, a number of ways. We're, we're going to um, be increasing both our educational and research spaces. And in an environment which uh, hopefully the sparks of innovation will fly. So we've picked areas where we have a particular expertise, clinical translational science, RNA biology, um, uh, gene therapy, gene you know, research into, mm -hmm. uh, into gene therapy. And we're going to uh, house those uh, scientific endeavors within uh, proximity to each other. And our expectation is that the sparks of innovation will then fly. So one thing that's very special about the Sherman Center is that mm. we will be bringing together uh, researchers who work under hoods and fume hoods with computational biologists who, who uh, partner with them. We'll put them in proximity to each other. And we'll have this very, ex the, the building is designed so that people are able to uh, uh, go from floor to floor without having to get on an elevator and makes a very big building hopefully feel like a very small environment. And in addition to that, we create some beautiful new educational spaces. So a student who's looking at coming to medical school or nursing school is going to see beautiful uh, simulation space, small learning communities. We create some campus spaces, a dining hall, new amphitheater, fitness center. So I actually think our, our medical school environment becomes greatly enhanced with the new building.